message that we sold like 630,000 something records in one night. So that's the first time I've ever done that shit. So thank you very much. If you're proud to be from this city, make some noise one time. Well, Jackie Dumpson, check it out, because Aubrey is about to do something that we didn't expect. Now, first and foremost, uh, Drake dropped the views from the six. A lot of mixed reviews. Somebody told me, oh, it's, it's like the best album since Thriller. Stop it. Somebody has told me, oh, my God, this is such garbage. You know what I mean? Ass juice. And again, both sides, I'm hearing very extreme reactions. And I'm like, yo, this shit's been out for like a day and a half. And I'm thinking like, yo, really? Like, you guys like have that strong opinions? Do you kind of get all the shit he's rapping about? Because I'm still figuring stuff out. Just kind of give it some time. And also, I always rem remind people when Take Care came out, listen, for the first like two weeks, everybody said it was garbage. And then I remember like two months later, I rolled up to the club, everybody was playing it, all right? So basically, people, especially on social media, they want to get a firm position as quickly as possible that they could stand out, all right? So give it some time. I'm going to give you my review. It's going to be an official review, a very fair review. Just wait for it, okay? However, let's talk sales. Because we all know that Apple Music gave Drake $19 million. $19 million make a lot of these niggas do a lot of shit, okay? $19 million. And the $19 million was for the radio show that he does, which is OVO Radio, him dropping exclusive songs on Apple Music. I'm not sure if they had a certain amount, which he did. And also for Views from the Six to actually be exclusive to Apple Music. Not forever. Not even forever. Okay. Kanye did it for a month and a half with Tidal. Allegedly, Drake is going to be doing it for only seven days. But seven days could matter a lot when this album is so anticipated, right? Drake is saying that he already moved 630,000 records first day. And what he's talking about, and we're not really sure because he could be talking about pre-sales plus the first day as opposed to just the first day, all right? Now, some experts, and I mean, I, I guess we could consider myself an expert as well because I've done my number crunching, but other sites that also deal with analytics, they have kind of evaluated data that's coming into them live, and they're making predictions as well. They're predicting he could do as many as 2 million records sold first week. That's ridiculous. A rapper? Two million? I mean, in Lil Wayne's prime, he never even touched or even approached two million first week. Okay, he did a million though, right? And I've been thinking that, yo, I don't think no rapper, even Drake, could get to a million first week because, again, streaming is popping, but streaming actually brings down the sales a little bit unless it's streamed at a ridiculous amount of pace, okay? Now, uh, here's the thing, right? Drake's album's packaged in a very unorthodox way where if you look on iTunes, they have it packaged as an album so you can purchase it as singles, okay? So if you're not listening to it on Apple Music, which is getting streaming data, or you're not trapping out the bandwidth, ski mask on, you have to buy the entire album, not one song. Like, say you just like one song, like, yo, you heard about this song called Hype. You're like, yo, I want to cop Hype. You can't even cop Hype by itself because it's packaged on iTunes, a part of an album. So you got to buy the entire album. So that's kind of helping the sales a little bit the exclusivity is hurting him but the packaging is helping him right so he's in a very weird position but apparently he's already sold 630,000 records he has no reason to fucking lie and possibly he could sell up to 2 million now here's my official prediction because I don't think he'll be selling no 2 million records I don't even think he's gonna hit a million I mean, I would love if he sold like five million just to kind of set the mark for hip hop and kind of make everybody know that hip hop is the best selling music, which is kind of historically has been at least for the first week. But I want him to sell good, but I don't think he's going to hit a mill, yo. The last person who did it was uh, Lil Wayne. I see him doing, I'm making a prediction right now, live while I'm doing this. He's going to be doing around 700,000, bet or between actually, between 700,000 to 975. I see him at 9, even like 88, 991. I don't see him getting the million. I mean, he might get the million, though. You know what I mean? Listen, all this 666 shit he's been chanting for the longest, maybe that's the Illuminati. Maybe they're going to get that million. But I'm just saying, I'm not predicting over a million. Some people have said up to two million. Okay? I'm going to stop short with one. However, the packaging of the album kind of helps him and forces people to buy the entire thing off iTunes. And the streaming service thing, it kind of restricts a lot of people. But again, Apple Music got like 30 million subscribers that are paying and more who are joining for free right now at a massive pace. So maybe it does kind of add up, but we will see, man. Look at Beyonce's sale. Beyonce sold a million first week, like with one of her albums. And then look at her last album, or Lemonade, it supposedly is going to only sell 600,000. This exclusivity shit doesn't always work out. 
All right. So we will see um, sales and we will get more projections within the next day and even the next weekend. We'll talk about the sales and expect a review from me very soon. But give me some time to live with it because, again, I haven't even made up my mind about it in either way. And even if you have, I would probably encourage you to listen to it some more if you like Drake or even if you want to have a very strong opinion about the album. Okay. Get in the comments. If you guys like, definitely subscribe to Boy Jack Academics. I'm out.